Hello and welcome to the Heat Signature Daily Challenge. It is the 19th of August and today we are bringing in three off-world security officers while killing as few people as possible. We are shaky, we are tough, we have a conk hammer, very nice sidewinder, and a few glitch traps. So yeah, this shouldn't be too much trouble. It's easy enough to not kill people and if they have shields then we can just glitch them off. All right, key carriers have glitch dash. Very nice. 40 seconds to escape, jammer gate, that's all fine. All right. Oh, that's that's a bit close. Let's let that go away. Okay. One of the slightly more annoying Docking points today. But hopefully it'll be fine. Oh, that was so close to two seconds. Oh, that was really close to two seconds. All right, v very good dock, very strong dock. Okay, so we can... Oh, and we're getting non-lethal guns as well. Nope. Cat wants out of the room. One second. only wanted just barely out of the room she decided to sit in the doorway I suppose all right guess I've got the door open for this one okay any place that the sidewinder is especially good probably here to here or something like that something like that all right uh, I can't remember if I finished this thought but we've got non-lethal options in our guns and shotguns as well which is also relevant I did not I thought I okay I guess I just used the sidewinder <laughs> I did not mean to use the sidewinder whoops um in that case I think I'm just gonna go down here Uh, the alarm, if I'm not careful, will go off. I prefer to not happen. So we're going to go like that. Missing out on that item, but probably don't need it. Oh, you've got the... Okay, 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 okay. I didn't need that sidewinder anyways. They're going to start setting off the alarm, but that's fine. Pick up Subverter. Dang, that's some good equipment. All right. Toss you. Get this moving. This is an awkward ship to leap from. That was a bonk. How is that a bonk? Ow, in the hell? Okay. Pick up those, I suppose. And then we do a shot. And then we try and get this around. This is an awkward pickup. Okay, at least didn't bonk there. Actually, probably wanted the ship's alarm to go off at the very end there so that it would veer off, but oh well. All right, this also would have been a good time to have the Sidewinder, but it's not quite ready. Although, this is a bit iffy with the shakiness. Okay, that worked out. All right. So yeah, definitely could have been under 10 seconds, but oh well. Oop. 
All right, we got glitch dash everywhere, which is just swell. Target fleas. We can take advantage of that with our handy dandy subverter. I could get one of the other guns, but I don't think I'll need them. Okay. Target. Oh, they're in. It's a little bit rare for them to be in the tip. Or in the front towards tip. Okay. How long would it take? This key's easy. This key's easy. So I could. I can get to the target extremely easy. But then I'd have to drag them all the way out to the window. And we don't necessarily need any more equipment because we've got the glitch trap. So I'm just going to set off the alarm. Hi, friends. Uh, I'm going to see if I can get you because you might have an item. There we go. No item. Go back in here and sure, drop a thing. Okay, so zoom out, zoom back in, get the subverter ready, and then we return to pod and we need to make sure to wait for the alarm to go off. All right, there we go. Then we can hop out. Go subvert, then we shotgun ourselves away and then sidewind back in. All right, telepad, hacked, target, uh, escaping. And we do need to capture them. So, one, two, three. And then one, two, three. There we go. Knowing the timing of how long it takes to get out of the ship's range is very helpful. Makes it much, much easier to get out and then go back in the, and have enough time to pick up the target. We used to spend way too much time going way too far, and then it's easy to lose the target. All right, we got shields everywhere. Tracker. I can subvert the tracker. You need to be careful not to subvert. Well, no, it's fine to subvert them, because they'll just shoot themselves and they have concussive guns, so that's fine. Many sentry guns, jammer, lots of guards. All right, all right, all right. And it is not target fleas. So we get to go through the whole ship. Do have multiple subverters, though, so we can get into a door. And it seems like a very nice door. To save some time on. go all right tracker it's potentially one of the worst places for you to be in <laughs> for me could technically get in and then oh, I need that key but I could sidewind to somewhere not in your range I don't think it's this is long enough. If it was long enough, I could 
If it was a long subverter, I think I could divert both of these doors. Now let's just check. Yeah, even that would be a little bit iffy. It's fine to subvert sentry guns because they're non-lethal. Unless... Okay. The exception would be if the sentry gun pointed towards a window, at which point someone could get shot out into space. All right, so you do, do can see until right here. And then I'm also safe before I've actually entered the ship past this airlock. Got a key up here, but that's just less easy to get than this one. If you shoot and it bounces off your shield and hits you, then that's bad. I have a glitch trap that I could use. All right, let's open this up. Let's try doing some shenanigans. It's not going to be far enough down. Can I? I can't remember if I can aim into the wall. I can do this. That's I was hope I was banking on it bouncing a second time. Okay. At this point I might just subvert this door. Uh no, subverter's really good for this. So I don't want to go all the way around for you. Uh, is there another point where I need the subverter? It would be nice here. It would be nice here. There's a lot of places that it would be nice for. Yeah, whatever. I'll figure it out. don't necessarily need it for the target because I've got the glitch trap. Got jammer. I don't know how I'm getting out of here. Probably using a sidewinder. figure something out. I'll leave my problems to a minute in the future, me. They'll figure something out, I'm sure. Okay. Go over here, get you to start walking. And then I can do a bash. I hope I don't hit them. Eh. That's not the biggest deal. And then get up. And starting to set off the alarm. That's fine. I don't care about the alarm. So I do need to actually capture you. Uh, 
I can just glitch trap you off into space. Oh, 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 you know what I can do? Maybe. Come on. <laughs> uh, I'll need. Okay, so we're gonna have to do a little bit of shenangling. Throw this. Let it hit me so that it stops its momentum. I can send you off into space. I'm smart. I do feel a bit clever about that. Uh, let's throw this to get you to stop moving. Don't want you interrupting things. And then we get this pod moving. worry about it blowing up thanks to the sovereign cold fire flexing its relevance okay and now before you get glitched off into space I need to go down here while the doors open and then you get caught by pod and I'll pick this up just in case so no one else happens to step on it somehow and then out I go. Yay, look at that. I feel clever about that. 13 seconds, pretty good for ship three. Okay. Very happy with that, 599. Very nice. Man, I waste. I really wasted some sidewinders. Chip one was the biggest waste, but it ended up fine, thanks to glitch dashing. All right, really happy with the day. Let's look at yesterday. We've got another five ninety nine. Very nice. We got Rena Tanoji Kenny coming in second. Zaza Za in third. 7-2 and Endless tied for fourth place. Very good job, everybody. And with that, that is all for today's daily challenge. Thank you for watching, and I hope to see you tomorrow for the challenge Saturday. Goodbye.